Hey guys, Christian here with Innovative IDM, and today I want to talk to you about one of my personal favorite products, the Omron G9 SE Safety Monitoring Relay. I really like this thing. There's so many features here that are just what I'm looking for whenever I'm looking for a good product. So the first thing that I'd like to point out is the form factor. I mean, look at this guy. He is lean. I mean, here's my phone up for comparison. Um, I mean, it's like Omron put this thing on the keto diet or something. Form factor, really small. So if you're installing this thing in an existing application, you're not really gonna have to worry a whole lot about, you know, do I have the panel space for it? And if you're specking in a new machine and you're thinking about adding one of these things, um, it's not like it's gonna make you step up to the next size panel or enclosure or anything like that. So, and there's a lot of brains that go into this. 17.5 millimeters and you get two safety inputs this is the standard model 201 so you get two standard inputs two safety inputs that can accept dry contacts or uh, light curtains safety scanners you know something transistor based um, and then you also have two safety outputs there are other models that you can get up to four safety outputs and ones where you can get a timer delay function so maybe if you have a an application where a machine has a you know big heavy spinning flywheel or something that you really need to let slow down before you allow somebody to enter into the enclosure or um, need something to cool down before someone goes in there that would be a perfect application for the time delay model um, one of the things i really love functionality about uh, safety monitoring relays is its ability to actually watch what's happening downstream. So it's not like a traditional relay where, you know, it gets its input and contacts close and you just hope and assume that what's happening downstream is what's really happening downstream. Uh, this has uh, feedback inputs. So you can actually see, okay, I did close the contacts on that force guided relay uh, down the line from me. So everything's all good. And if I didn't, I'm gonna stop what I'm doing. I'm gonna stop the process. Um, <clears throat> so, really handy, useful feature there. You'll also notice four lights on the front face of this product. So, traditionally, conventional models will have a power light so that you know that it's on, and then it will have the status of the outputs. So, Omron actually went a step beyond that, and they said, okay, we'll tell you about what's going on with the power. We'll tell you the function or the, the status of the outputs, but we're also gonna tell you the status of the inputs too. This may not sound like a lot, okay, but when you have multiple devices coming into this relay and you're having machine troubleshooting issues and you think it has something to do with one of your safety devices acting up, this can save you a ton of time trying to chase down those problems and track down what's actually going on and fix it so that you can get your machine back up and running. I mean, this is also just a nice little touch here. I always like this for when uh, you have a device and the manufacturer goes ahead and, and they put on the the wiring diagram, that the, the diagram for you know what all the inputs and outputs are, and you know it obviously has all the terminal labels clearly labeled here, uh, cage clamp style inputs, right? So if you have a ferruled wire, you don't even need a tool. You can just push in all of your wires here and you're good to go. If you need to take them out, all you need is a screwdriver, flathead screwdriver, push it in there, and you're done. Um, a lot of conventional models will have the stair step style, which has always baffled me because in order to get the wire into the terminal on the top of the safety relay, you put the wire in and then you have to like torque the screw kind of around the wire and you're like bending the wire and probably pulling it out as you're tying down the screw. I don't know, it's crazy to me. Um, I don't understand why manufacturers think that's a good idea, but Omron doesn't because look, they gave me the, my favorite, my cage clamp style relay uh, terminals. So, um, you know, that's really about it. That's all I got to say on this one. I'm gonna be featuring this in some later videos, uh, some applications, real life type examples so that you guys can kind of see how important and helpful it is to have one of these things. So uh, if you guys have any questions, please give me a call or email me. I'll put those 
somewhere. And uh, yeah, enjoy the week.